Lance Ork here, and welcome back to another camp tour. So today, we are located in the Ash Heap. It's my first time ever building here. We're located right here, just south of the Mount Blair. Got the Rusty Pick right here, and Vault 76 is all the way up here. So, got a little a little nostalgic about the red rocket with the deep junk walls being added. So, if you like what you see, so hit that subscribe button and let's get started. So, here we are. Got the old red rocket little mega structure that they first released. Got a little crane in the background. So, let's go check it out here. So, all around here, got a bunch of junk walls with some various appliances set up. So even over here, we got a little truck here with some junk in it, supported by some cement truck wheels. That's what I was looking for. Inside, we got a nice little courtyard here, and this is this build is used uses only prefab structures. So, got a nice little courtyard here, we got a little chicken coop, got our brahmin here, got a nice little sitting area, this is a sitting area I really like, we got some music, so, over here we got a little, the little new stash box here with the car actually facing the correct way this time, with a little toolbox and stein, like, like you're working on the car, here we got Nice little garage here with some nice light up posters. Then you got display a little legendary run board. This red rocket station is really nice because the way you can clip everything to it, it really makes it nice and easy. Then we got the spotlights, which don't worry, they work all the way, all that well. I keep on replugging them in every single time. It's a bit annoying. Over here, we got a small little farm here with a well, a rainwater collector, a nice little bed set up here with some mattresses, the new uh, sleeping bag on it, a nice little cooking station. So let's go check out this little train car here. So over here, we just got a nice little sitting area here. Using some like pallet foundations to get it, make it look kind of like more put together. It's like this is what you would be able to really make in scavenge. So inside here, we got the train car. Nice little pseudo tiny house here. Got some brewing stations. We got a small little kitchen net here with some supplies here. We even got a fridge in here. Got some tables with extra seating this time. Got a chair. Got some comics to read. Got, got, got a new little a table set up here brain. with some shelves. For got gross. populated in, in them. Got some more shelves here. Got some plushies. Some planetarium lights all around. Makes it look like it's being lived in. Got a nice little pistol display case here. We got some nice lights along the ceiling. The, the weird kitchen cabinet that usually never gets placed anywhere. So over here, we got access to a little dumpster here so you can throw away all, all your rubbish. Camp good use and over here we got the corpses. Nuka Girl stats cut out here. What I really like is I didn't notice this before, but posters have backs to them, and just coincidentally, they lined up perfectly. They could still see Grognak and the evil sorcerer. So over here, we got another bed here. Same setup as the other one, except this one has a Charleston Fire Department one made by Robco. 
This one is where you pass out first. You get in be next to the outhouse and Brahmin. So, don't pass out first. And here we got just the ammo converter with the obligatory vendor. So we got a nice little windmill up top. That's just for looks. As everything is really powered by the single wireless generator up there. And the red rocket is powered by a fusion generator. Out in the distance right there you see a nice little decontamination arch. Right here we got a nice little missile turret defense system. Got the mount flare. So this was built because of the junk walls edition. And since there's a truck here, decided to make it part of the wall itself. So, if you guys like what you see, be sure to hit that subscribe button. It really helps out. And I hope you all have a wonderful day.